Thank you. Okay. Ah, oh, what? Start me in the view of all of them? Oh, man. Freaking buttholes. Oh, a whole set of arrows. All right. You know what? Ugh. Uh, no. Ah. God, just give me... How did that guy die? Who lit him on fire? <laughs> what happened? Okay, bud. That's enough. Okay, this guy is relentless. Ugh, one stab with the fire? That's not cool. That thing's a piece of shit, too. It's just a piece of wood. Alright, so that strategy's not working. Using up all my arrows. Looking good. If they didn't die, I swear. Oh my lord. That's crazy. Uh, just... can heal, don't worry. Let's see. Uh... There we go. Oops. Somebody died. Hmm. Well, let's uh, chuck this boy. Got him. Ah, oh, the Boko Club burned out. Guys over there like, oh, what happened? Oh, your friend got murdered. Sorry. No, you stay away. That was worth it. Guy's been murdering me every time. Sneaky river snail. Couple of arrows. I'll take it. Hey bud, what you doing over there? You fishing? No surprise for you. Oh man. Ah. Okay. Well, there really wasn't a reason to come over here because there ended up, oops, uh, ended up not being a treasure chest. So you know, I died a few times for 
I know reason. But at least we can collect some of this garbage. Uh, actually, I'll take Garrus. That's a worthy cause. What? What? Oh, Lord in heaven. I even ran away from it. It's the most indestructible box in history. Okay, I missed, but you know. The box is dead, that's the important part. It can't hurt me anymore. Now that. That's what I've been looking for the whole time. But fine, whatever. It's fine. We got what we want. Everybody's dead, we're alive. Uh, and I need to eat a fish. Five of them, oh baby. You got a lot of arrows. So this is worthwhile. Worth a few <laughs> horrendous deaths. Ooh, there we go. Yeah, how many arrows do we have now? 23. Oh boy. <gasps> Give me your horse. I need it. There's two of them. Who's coming first? Ah. Ah. All right. That's all I wanted this whole time, okay? You're okay, little fella. Oh, okay. Good night, sweet prince. There it is. I would love to register this horse. This is a beaut. Oh, Lord. Oh, those jerks. Wait, I need to recharge my stuff. Okay. I think we can make this swim. Maybe. Is the current going away from me, though? Oh, I don't know about this. Somehow the current is going this way. Uh, I'm gonna drown. Is this a game over? This is put me on the shore. Okay, let's go to the shore. Down a heart. All right. That's fine. Ah, that's not okay. Where are you at? Ah. Ah. What? He was so deadly when you're an early noob. You just die to everything all the time. I don't want that balloon. Dang it. At least I got my arrows back. Okay. Let's go up here and jump off a cliff. Gently glide over. NBD. All right. Look at us solving puzzles, killing Octoroks, living. It's a good time. It's good stuff. Oh no. Flower puzzle. Where'd she put me? Okay. All right, fine. Um, so there is a shrine there, and there's a shrine there. Looks like we're shrine hunting in the early part of this, huh? Uh... 
I'll uh, touch one. Come on. Wish I could have just flown all the way there. This is a pain in my tuchus. This is our eighth shrine. There's two more we see. There's a third one closer to the tower. Doing okay. Getting some shrines. Has 120 shrine runs, so got a lot to do. Nice. Ah. Oh. All right. That's not how that works, but okay. All right. Popped up under my own ice, so it destroyed it, which and then in turn blew up the bomb. Get. I really don't need to do this. I could just jump over here and bomb this thing. Funny the difference between like intended early game shrines and intended late game shrines because I did some last night that took a very long time to beat um, and then these ones are nothing interesting Okay, well, we did your thing, so bye. There's one up here, one over there. Neither of them are far. And yeah, not even as far as this one was. Okay. So we'll go north first. Eh, let's go west first. Oh. Is he still over there? He is! But he's not quite mine yet, so he's not gonna come. 
That's, uh... All right, we're taking the boat. All right. <laughs> you get the... the most embarrassing of all deaths. Okay, humiliating death. Dying to a Korok leaf. These guys too. Where you at? Yeah, we got a bunch. Let's stay out. Let's go get our horsey, so all of this goes faster. This thing really gets moving, huh? Don't kill me, Raft. Okay. Okay, guy, you stayed. I like you. Ooh, there's another one. Dang. Or is that the one? That might be the one. I think this is the one. Yeah. That is quite close. Say the most random shit when you run by in this game. Mm, eggs in the hot springs. Like what? This horse just like obedient out the gate. I love this horse. Hang tight, buckaroo. I'll be right back. Bad. Oh, there's a stable somewhere nearby. I can claim him. <laughs> Metal connections, which means... Oh, I remember this dumb. Can I climb these? Yes. Big money, cool. Um. So I think there was like a cheating way to do this. Let's see. Put you there. Oh, no. unintended strats. It's like my favorite thing to do in games. Okay, be very careful. There we go. I don't know if I can get the third one. It's not a slant. Unintended strats. My favorite. Can't. The question is, can I grab this? I cannot. No. Unintended strats may mean nothing. Sir, some awesome dude. What's up? 
I'm doing goofy things in this game. I don't I don't think I can get over there. I don't think this is tall enough to reach all the way down. It's not. Alright, so this is useless. It's fun though to do that. Oh gimme. Dang. I guess I'll stack them up. Like I was supposed to in the first place. BRB, no worries, man. Just having some shrine fun. I don't think there's any fun way to do this. I think I just have to do it. Okay. I may also be jumping the gun just a touch. I don't know if I can get over there from here. Just kidding. Ah. No, this is not. Let's move it over to the other. Yeah, I have to move this whole stack over. And then this goes on top. Well, but how would I get up here? So I guess that's not true. Would this reach? No, not even close, right? Hmm. Oh, but it doesn't have to. I don't have to be up here. This is just to get this piece. Oh, okay. Let's just... No! Oh! Yeah, at least slide the whole stack. Gently move it over. Just a bit. I just don't think that's quite close enough. Just a touch. Oh. That'll do. Yeah. All right, intended strats. It's fine. We'll take it. All right. So that gives us uh, nine tries. 111 to go. <laughs> NBD. 5,000 IQ. Intended strats, 5 billion IQ. I did what the game wanted. How's your night going, man? I'm going to claim this horsey. It's a good boy. It has not fought me at all. Beetle! Oh, my boy. One of my favorite characters in Zelda ever. Yeah. I'm doing it now. I do. Oh. Register horse. Gentle temperament. Max Bond. Look at that. I just jumped on its back and it was good to go. I stole it from the Bokoblin. It's like fine. It's a fine. It's called a starter horse. Ooh. 
Okay, well, it's not the ultimate horse, but the Poe Knot seems fitting. <laughs> name it Todd. I'll name the next one Todd. It's too late. This is a Poe Knot because it's not a Pona. Get it? Get it? Uh, it's late. <laughs> Oh yeah, now that he's registered. Okay, on my map, there was one more location I wanted to go to. All the way up here, okay. Hang on, what's, what's Beetle got? Hey. Yeah, it's an amiibo, right? The Pona? Yeah. I love Beetle so much. His abs are a little too good in this one, but I still love him. I mean, he was really fit in Skyward Sword, so I guess the lore fits. Wolf Link, really? Like the outfit? Look what I've got. Let's sell some gemstones and such. I love Beetle. But I get a diamond. For reals? Holy cow. Uh, we're rich. Like literally rich already. It's good because you need a billion rupees for stuff later. Alright, what do we need from you? Wolf Link to follow you around. Is that real? Like, for real skis? Bye. I always stock up on all the arrows I can carry. Wow. Oh. 39, there we go. It's pretty much all I come to beetle for. Except for actual beetles. Anybody interesting with side quests in here? Nope. All right, we're out of here. Come on, a Ponot. Should have named it not Pona. Man, missed opportunity. Next one. We'll get the next one. Don't fight me. Max Bond, remember? Tap the Wolf Link amiibo. Oh, no way. I had no idea. Some great amiibo stuff in this game. It's like a just a good use of amiibo in general. Man, this world's so huge. I love it. Oh boy. Yikes, that was close. Okay, we're safe. Woof. Almost had a never ending story moment there. Yeah. I'd have been <laughs> devastated. I can't believe that almost happened. I don't think it would let... I feel like I, I didn't even stop the horse. I think it just went in. Oh, Fox, don't touch that. I see it up there. Oh, no. Might have killed a great egret. And they added all sorts of wildlife to this. There's ducks. I saw pigeons. Like... All sorts of random stuff got added to this game. Stop, 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 stop. Here's what I want to do. I want these apples. I'm going to climb this tree. And then I want to try to sail across. Try being the operative. I feel like that's the better tree over here. I need chew jellies for things later, right? I forget what for. Some sort of potion. This seems like the proper tree. A little taller, too. I can't believe there's ducks in this. Well, this is a fast river. 
I don't know. I don't know, gang. Can we stand up on that rock? This is the clincher. Come on, that's standable. That's, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm a genius. <laughs> and I ran out of stamina. <laughs> Certainly a qualifying factor for geniuses. Another stable. Oh. Oh. Where did that go? How did Beetle get here? I have so many questions. Bought a pack of bootleg and me book. Oh, right. On the wish. They actually work. I think you told me that. That's amazing. Bootleg amiibos. Somebody just copied the codes into, <laughs> into QR codes. It's incredible. don't think the horse works in here like oh okay this is deeper than I thought equals no energy. That's exactly right. I mean, those geniuses can't run, right? Is that a stereotype? I can run. Guess I'm not a genius. Feels bad, man. Oh my god! This is the most powerful arrow in the world! I hope his stuff floats. Seraph, what's up, dude? Just woke up. Do you have a nice nap? Or sleep, <laughs> since it's so late. You've only missed uh, a couple of shrines. Nice. It does float. Wait. Oh, no. I think I need to be up on something to cast this. I do. Okay. Four choices. That's okay. Those are the only kind that I make. Terrible against arrows. Good day, sirs. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Don't kill me. Okay. I remember this being more difficult. Oof. Okay. Glad I did that. Next. <laughs> I kind of remembered that being a thing. So what's up, man? We have six? Okay. So we have ten total. We, we've hit the, the double digits mark. Pretty sure that's all the ones that I saw. So let's go to Kakariko because there's two more at least on the way. Can I see any more from here? Yeah, there's at least two more on the way. Which means that we can get 12 so I can get five hearts and start on my stamina wheel. Love that guy. Wow. 
More arrows, please. Gotta go. No worries, man. Hope you're doing all right. Um, are you going to be around for friend day tomorrow? I would actually like to do it. <laughs> Everybody's around. If not, let's play Breath of the Wild. The bigs. Oh, yeah. We got bought all the arrows. Okay. Goodbye. Any fun characters? Nobody. Just the bard. Yeah. Ancient songs. Oh. A parrying? No, I haven't even tried it yet. No thanks. Oh. It's like an out of necessity skill and I have not needed it yet. You just block, right? You pull up the shield, like at the precise moment that it hits you, the beam hits you. It doesn't even have to be the beam, right? It could be anything. And then there's the, like, the, there's a flurry rush. Fury rush, flurry rush. If you dodge at the right moment, right? It's all coming back to me. Look at all those creepy guardians. Ooh, what's this? Bag of Rocks 21. Thank you for the follow, man. Much appreciated. I hope you like 120 shrine runs. Uh, welcome to the stream. We have played every Zelda game in existence, uh, except for the CDI games in Hyrule Warriors, because those don't count. Um, this is the 19th game that I've played this year. I beat 18 other Zelda games, starting from Zelda 1, man. It has been quite the grind. So, welcome. Uh, you're going to need to if you want to kill, I know, the immobile ones. I mean, you can just go whoop on them, too, when you, when you have good weapons. Like, let, or guardian gear. But that also takes a while to get. Okay, so he's just telling the story of Hyrule? Come on. Oh, the music's so good. I was going to cancel it, but I love the organ music. Straight out of Ganon's Castle on OOT. So good. But then it changes. So epic. They did it. Okay, I'm skipping. <laughs> That's enough of that. We have stuff to do. All right, horsey. Let's roll. Uh, horsey. Hello? Where the heck did horsey go? Ponot. Yes, that's his name. Uh, I'm so confused. May I have my horse, please? Oh. 
I found a... <laughs> I couldn't quite bring myself to name this horse Epona, so it is Eponot. What's going on, dude? There's Eponot. Wait, I think we can teleport. I don't even think we need to ride the horse. Yeah, we can. <laughs> My horse is probably like, what in the F? I don't think I've ever teleported off the back of a horse before. Get home from work? Oh my lord. What time is it? Two? Jeez. Well, no wonder you got that other thing. The hard work. It's the ethic. Alright, I know there's a shrine in here. Let's go get it. Ooh. How do I... Can I bomb this? In terms of we wanted a beer? Oh, yeah, that's uh, that's worthwhile. Yeah! Ah! Wait. Okay. Thought I ruined it. I should have known that you could bomb those. I think my entire first playthrough, I, like, wasted weapons destroying it. Oh, no, the rain. Oh, God. Uh, is that worth it? No. And kinda. I mean, the salt is, because you can make tasty meats. Ah! Unless you had, you can do all the shrines and just go fight Ganon. I know. I know, you guys would be okay with it. Yeah. Uh, I'd like to do the Divine Beast, too. Why not? They're a big part of the game. No, my salt. I'm not going down for that one. Maybe I won't blow this up simply because I kind of want the stuff to not fall. Yeah, that's much better. <laughs> All right, where's the shrine at? What's your weekend looking like, man? Uh, you around for friend day tomorrow, or should I play some Breath of the Wild? I don't have any reports yet. For Smash Friend Day, for, by the way, for those of you. I get a new follower tonight. Bag of Rocks. This is his name. Her name. Not sure. His or her. Back and forth. Right now my laptop's broken. Gotta check some stuff. Okay, no worries. All right, what do we got in here? Friday no go. Switch treasure at home. Womp womp. Well. At least we know we won't be leaving Sir F out in the cold. I know he he loves Friend Day. I mean, I do too, but he also loves Breath of the Wild. <laughs> so it's not going to be a huge disappointment if we, if we screw up. Where are the treasure chests in this one? Oh, man. Oh, there's one over there. I might be there for friend day. Okay, cool. I'll put out the call tomorrow morning if I remember in Discord and we'll see who's around. Is there a reason to be down here? No, right? Okay.
Okay, so somehow I have to get this to tilt. Hmm. But how? Can I? Amazing. Okay, we figured it out. I feel like I'm actually smarter this time around. <laughs> like, actually more intelligent. <laughs> like, I would have never thought to do that last time. I don't know what's wrong with me. Ooh. Very nice. I don't have anything yet with armor, so we're going to look like a dirty hippie. Let's go. And really, my clothes look like a dirty hippie. It's not good. I'm going to get some armor. Start buying indie games. Dude, you should. What kind of games do you like? Because I can point you to some amazing indie games. Also, uh, I don't know if you know this, I'm the CEO of a startup called Jump. It's a subscription service for indie games. Um, it's $4.99 a month, but we do have a two-week trial. So if you want to just go try it for free, you can totally do that. Give it a shot. There's 120 games on there currently. And we're making some changes, but uh, yeah. Go try Jump, man. It's free. Hollow Knight is incredible. Um, recently, I actually played Celeste on stream. Celeste was great. I'm a big fan of roguelikes, so I liked uh, Rogue Legacy and in particular FTL. FTL was incredible. Uh, also like Don't Starve. Survival game. Oh, I'm definitely throwing a bomb in the middle of these dummies. What other great indie games are there? Oh, one died. Oh my god. <laughs> All dead. Oh god, I love this game so much. Like, how fun is that? You get to figure out. You get to figure out how you murder everybody. It's the best. Okay, I think this one deserves a bomb. I'm gonna jump down anyway. Oh, good. Soldier's broadsword. Ooh. What don't we want? Oh, that's that one. Uh, honestly, I think we're good. This is a weapon, though. Something's getting dumped. Ironically, probably the soldier's broadsword. Mm. I don't know about all that. Not a fan of the boomerangs in this game. Still on fire. Um, on jump, my favorite indie games would probably be uh, Pony Island. Freaking super weird game, but amazing. Um, there's a shard! Oh shit. Uh, yeah, we gotta go, right? We gotta do that. Can my horse come over here? Too far. Dang. Crap! Uh, gotta go get that shard. It is really up there.
What other good indie games are on Jump? Can't remember at the oh. current moment. Some great ones, though. I swear, if that little load where my horse came out de despawned it, okay. Also, here are Korok, so we're coming back. I am back, okay. Oh, no, we were um, trying to give suggestions to some awesome dude on indie games to check out. He said he's thinking about getting indie games, and I told him indie games are the freaking best. Oh, I want that blue horse. I know it's hard to get, and I don't have any stamina, so it's probably impossible. Can I get up there? I don't know. We're gonna find out. Will this guy go up the hill like a mountain goat? Uh, yes. Oh, it's so far. All right, we need to go over there. I don't know if he's gonna get down from here. Come on. This is gonna take some doing. Well, we are in a pickle. Uh-oh. Uh, limbo was great. Yep. Oh, well, this is upsetting. Maybe if I... <clears throat> Excuse me. Is it still there? Don't care about any of you? Is the shard still there? Oh no, is it gone? F. It's gone, and I put my horse on the top of a hill. Totally gone. Shoot. Yeah, Limbo, and then the follow up to Limbo. <clears throat> Shovel Knight is amazing, yep. The follow-up to Limbo was called uh, Inside. Also an amazing indie game. Just great freaking games. What am I going to do? Distraction tactics. Wait, what? Oh, I can't crouch and hold an arrow. Or an apple, apparently. The more you know. So let me come eat that apple. Or run, I guess that's fine. Whatever. I didn't want you anyway. Canes of Hyrule. No, it's totally an indie game. Uh, Canes of Hyrule was made by the exact same guys that did Crypt of the Necrodancer, so it was a skinned version of Crypt of the Necrodancer. Totally an indie game. So yeah, Cadence Viral obviously would be a recommendation for the Zelda stream. It's so good. Well, hello. Emblazoned shield? What? Really, really good. Totally worth it. It was incredible. Yeah, it didn't even matter that it was short, because if you wanted to replay it, it would be very different the next time around, right? It's a roguelike-ish. Roguelite? I don't know what you would call it. I about this whole graveyard. Give me all the parts. Just waiting for one of these to secretly be alive. I don't actually remember if any of them are secretly alive.
Yep. Map changes, you keep some stuff after dying. It's very roguelike. Right, yeah. It just tells you, like, all right, you need to randomly find this, and then, okay, next is this. <laughs> like, that's pretty much all you get, which is great. If you like roguelikes, you would like FTL and Rogue Legacy. Those are both amazing roguelikes. And Cadence of Hyrule's original game, uh, Crypt the Necro Dancer. That is a great game. I feel like I've missed some more. Crypt of the Necro Dancer. There we go. Yeah, sometimes I need to enunciate more. I don't know what's wrong with me. I speak so fast. My brain goes so quickly that I can't say the words. Ow! Give me that frog. Ah! Oh, guess what we're gonna do. You know what I hear dogs love? Apples. No, don't. Get it, Pepper. Look at the apple. Look at him. Yeah. Get it. Oh, he loves it. I just want a pet. Why can't I pet? Let me pet. Let me pick it up like you used to be able to in Twilight Princess. Beetle, dude. Yeah. I've already met up with him a couple times. He's got to be putzing around somewhere around here. All right, we're going to go jump off that rock. This is the life. Staring at stuff. Not knowing what to do. I'll show you the life. I'm a paraglider, dang it. I love that the paraglider is like this mystical thing. And it's really just like some cloth and some wood. I don't know why I find that so funny. But it's, it's like the most basic item. Alright. Also seems to have the rebel, sig the rebel alliance symbol on it. Beeble. All right, this is good. This gives us twelve, and then there's going to be one above Kakariko too, so thirteen, and we can turn these in in Kakariko. So we're able to get our first, we get a fifth heart and our first stamina piece. It's ridiculous. Like, it's just... It's just wood. Wood and some cloth. Like, bro, I don't know what to tell you, but this is not a special paraglider. Come on! Game. Alright. Oh, boy. Okay. Rico. Kako Rico? Uh, I think it actually is Kakariko because the ancient ruler of Hyrule called it Kakariko when I was getting my ancient paraglider from him. I'm almost positive. You should go look up that scene on the internet and see. Almost positive. 
I hate that you pronounce something wrong. I, I got caught out. Oh, Gerudo or Gerudo? I still don't know. I could be. I've been saying Gerudo my entire life. That could be wrong. I have no idea. Hmm, where is the, where are the treasure chests in this one? Way the f up there. Oh. Sticking the ice shard in last second. Yeah, that's a good one. Alright, so here's what we gotta do. We're gonna go here. Oh, wait. That's fine. And then here. And then here. Money. All right. Okay, it's twelve. Nice. Shield serving is amazing. I already did it once in this game, in this playthrough. And we were up in the snowy parts of the Great Plateau. We surfed a smidge. Just a touch. I know. When you, I mean, you can get really up into the hills and like see and do some stuff up there, but it's uh, yeah, you know, takes some effort. <laughs> oh, the spikes are gone. Cool. There's your boy. It's, it's our fan favorite. Beeble. All right, where's where's Horsey at? Ponot. Is he still up on that hill? Please tell me he's not over there. Okay. okay. He at least got down. That's good. Hey. My dog. Uh, I'm probably gonna play for another half hour or so. I gotta wake up around eight tomorrow. So, and I haven't slept much all week because I, you know, my wife said to go in for the surgery at 6 a.m. She had to be at the hospital, and then today she had to be there at like 8.30. Um, in the middle of traffic time in L.A., so we had to leave early for the post-op. All is well, don't worry. It was very minor. Wait, what am I doing? But yeah, I haven't slept a ton this week, so it would be nice to sleep. Look at those little doofuses over there. On the map, just straight north. Okay, you can do that. Oh god! Okay, this is happening. <laughs> oh boy! All right. Man, I can't believe I missed that star piece. I just went the wrong way. I want that blue horse so bad. Jump. Get out of the way, dude. Yeah. On your left. <laughs> so yeah, if nobody's around for friend day tomorrow, I will yeah. happily stream more Breath of the Wild. Yeah. Don't you worry. Ever get Ganon's horse? Uh, no, I didn't even know you could. I know there's like 30 different types of horses. I got the giant horse, that took some doing. And then I think I got the royal horse, the white one. That was cool. Shackala! One of my favorite boys. Forgot there's a little side quest.
Ah, uh, boy, has to. What are you gonna do? By far the best part of this game is trying to figure out how to do fights. How are we gonna knock these dummies off? Good day, sir. That was a bust. I mean, it has to until I was a hundred hour mark. You just, you just ran right by him the first time. You're like, I don't need this fella. All right, for some reason, the wind is blowing mightily. Uh, don't come closer. I want to throw you off the far edge. Yep. Dang it. Where'd your bed go? What happened? Yep. Oh, good night. I think I did this one time where I blew people off the edge and one of them didn't die and so I had to go chase him down because you can't finish this quest until they all die. <laughs> Never went up to this area for such a long time. You didn't go to... It's like the first thing it tells you to do is go to Kakariko and you just, <laughs> just didn't do it. Just rambled off and you're like, bye. Never coming back. It's so funny. It's like the one piece of direction in this entire game is go to Kakariko Village and talk to Impa. And you're like, eh. That's amazing. That's the beauty of this game, man. You do whatever the heck you want. <laughs> Just mumbling maracas to himself. Oh god. Didn't see him, yeah. I mean, you, you could have climbed up over the hill. Nobody's stopping you. God, I love this so much. All right. I've got some seeds. Give me some stuff. Weapon sash, please. Two weapons and one bow. I basically don't use shields, so I'm not gonna bother with shields. <laughs> uh, this game is just. It's too good. It's too good. No, oh man. Crap, I forget where he is. Korok Forest. I think he's in the forest, like the Lost Woods where... Or no, he's somewhere else and then he goes there. Maybe not. I can't remember. I know he ends up in the Lost Woods where the... Um, I'm blanking on the freaking sword's name. The Master Sword. He's where the Master Sword is. Stop. 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 I do love the Korax. I just wish it wasn't so tedious to get all of them. It is really rough. I can also admit, a lot of Zelda games grind them so much I wouldn't fight the final boss. Yeah, you said you didn't do that for this one either, right? 
I'll admit that um, I actually probably played like 60 hours of this and like the last 30 were just pussing around. Like I just I didn't want to finish it because it was so good. But that's partially why I did this um, playthrough endeavor, the Zeldathon, because I wanted to finally finish a bunch of them. I hadn't done like four or five of them ever. I hadn't played several of them. And I never beat Skyward Sword, which I kind of regretted, so... All done now. We've beaten all the games, man. So, I feel you. That happens. It's like, you don't want them to end, because you know that that's pretty much it, right? So... I understand. Wow. Yeah. It's such a good game. I wonder how many hours my first playthrough actually ended up being. Yeah. It's up there, right? I think it's up there. I forget how to get up there. Had to beat it to feel, I know. Plus Ganon's like... I mean, his patterns aren't that bad in this game, but like, he is kind of tough. Super intimidating. It's a good, it's a good boss fight. Like, very good. I've only done it once. I, uh, I didn't finish my Master Mode playthrough. I got maybe like two thirds of the way in and stopped. Two divine beasts, three divine beasts, something like that. Never did finish it. Master Red's all right. It's just that you know they regen health. Yeah, there's soundtrack's fine. Um, it's kind of sparse. You know, mostly what you hear is random field music. <laughs> but no, there's so many good soundtracks. OT and MM, dude. Those will always, always have the best. Upbeat, is, yeah. Yep, I agree. Oh, we're gonna learn the parry, aren't we? Yeah, it's very like mystical and meandering <sighs> what we got eightfold blade Oh, there's the parry. So good. Master Sword still takes 13.5 hearts. Yeah, what was the significance of that again? Thirty point seven five. It's one of the only tutorials in this game. Ow. Yeah, 
Yo, is there a significance to that many hearts? I think it's a decimal, but who knows? We'll find out. <laughs> Stay tuned. Okay, we learned the parry. We're in business now. Okay, yeah. It is just really cool. Like, you try to go grab when you have 10 hearts and you just die. Like, you're not worthy, you know? It's mythical. And they make it even more mythical because you have to be super strong and far into the game to get it. Work with all these other weapons this whole time. It's so good. This game really is just so good. I'm so pumped they're making another one. <laughs> Some nerd probably knows. I know. There seems to be a bunch of corpses around it, you would think. Maybe the Korok carry them out of there, because they're whimsical little demon children. Stamina vessel, please. Yeah. That's the goods. That's the stuff. scared of over there. <laughs> Do a little dance? Probably. Freaking Korox. There he is. Imagine this guy just carrying a body out like, yeah, ha ha. <laughs> I don't know the creator of the Master Sword. Is there, I mean, I played through the whole series. I don't remember there being lore. It was always just this mythical blade. I don't think they ever explained it. We we'll played all the games. I don't remember that as a story, you know. Goddess Hylia created it. I mean, she created everything, I guess, so that makes sense. What game is that explained in? Some awesome dude. Why don't you guys chill out? The Goddess Sword. Oh, and Skyward Sword, right? Hmm. Interesting. What up? <clears throat> he loves Skyward Sword. This is his favorite game. I also love it now. I need to. So one thing I need to do after this. Uh, opponents, I, I need to edit a video of me beating all the games in maybe like I don't know, 180 seconds max, three minutes of me playing. Um, with just moments from each game. And then I also need to do a definitive take, like a ranking on the games and why. I feel like that would be good for the channel, right? Those two things. Quite a long time, Link. I am much older now, but you remember me. All right, if, it, if this is a cutscene, I'm going to go grab a water. I'll be right back. Or do I have to press buttons? Oh. I do. Never mind. Oh, no, my background. Yeah, I feel like those would be good, right? The edited video I have to do, just because I want to show people that I beat all the games this year. Um, and I'm sure there's like hilarious moments from all of them. Just me, me at the end of Zelda 2, like... Um, repairing up the Goddess Sword with Flames. 
Skyward Sword, you're creating... Oh, wow, I like that. I like that lore a lot. But anyway, you know, a couple of games shifted around in my list from playing this, so I need to make a definitive list in Y. I'm not gonna read that on stream. <laughs> A hundred years to deliver this message. Oh, what? I'm ready. Is this a cutscene? Yes. Okay. Be right back. I'm gonna grab a water. The history of the royal family of Hyrule is also the history <laughs> of Calamity Ganon, a pride <laughs> of evil game. that has endured over the. That's a tough one. Not a lot of streamers play it. It seems really difficult, like a really tough learning curve. Back time and time again, by a warrior wielding the soul of a hero. And a princess who carries the blood of the goddess. With the passage of time, each conflict with Ganon faded into legend. So listen closely as I tell you of this legend that occurred 10,000 years ago. Hyrule was then blossoming as a highly advanced civilization. Even the most powerful monsters posed little threat to the denizens of the realm. The people thought it wise to utilize their technological prowess to ensure Whoa, the states. safety of the land. Should calamity get Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Sorry, I was trying to get water. <laughs> Hydrates the heck out of me talking this much. Anyway, hello. I hope you like 120 shrines, because that is what we're doing. How do we look? Yeah, we've beaten... Thanks, Fiona. We've beaten it. every other Zelda game in the series, the main series, as well as Cadence of Hyrule since the beginning of 2019 so i'm to the background it's been quite the year if you have any interest in watching any of those playthroughs if you ever get bored all my vods are on my youtube but otherwise i'll be on somewhere between 9 and 10 p.m pacific every night play for a few hours breath of the wild it's gonna take me probably a couple months to do this but when it's done, we will have beaten every Zelda game except for the CDIs and Hyrule Warriors because I don't count it. <laughs> One point in this game, Zelda says she hears a voice in the sword. Oh man, Fee lives? Fee lives? That'd be so amazing, even though she would just give us 80 tutorials if she had still lived. I would be quite pleased if she were still alive though. It was a sad moment at the end of that game. The darkness delivered his final blow. This is going to be a fun playthrough, though. I appreciate you guys joining me on my journey through Hyrule. <laughs> now that's good music. Yeah. Ooh, excuse me. Okay. Imagine being asleep in a sword. I know. Hey, she enjoys it. It's her home. It's like the genie. <laughs> I 
Maybe Zelda have a better voice actor in Breath of the Wild too. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> Her voice actor is just not good in this. I think she's whining. Just gonna mark him. Okay, there's our four divine beasts. This is it, like, this is the only direction you get in this entire game. It's like, go to these four places. Good luck. Tenna Village. Yeah, give us that mark. Nice. It's a good next place to go. Yeah, I don't know. She just... Eh. Didn't do it for me. What's this guy got? He knows where some memories are. Hmm. There's a tower somewhere that he's painting by waterfalls. Hmm. You out, dude? Get some sleep. Me too. All right. If I don't see you tomorrow, enjoy your weekend. You gonna come, uh... Hang I think we'll probably do Breath of the Wild. I think we only have... One, maybe two people here for games tomorrow. But yeah. Either way, I'll see you tomorrow, man. Have a good one. So I wonder if Grey State's followed and then unfollowed, because I'm still only showing 125. <laughs> Either way, glad he stopped by. Later, dude. Good to see you, man. Which one of these? This is the stealthy one? Oh, I can't afford it. How about the clunky one? Or just the better one? Yeah. I love the look of the tunic anyway. And the pants. Is this doing climb speed up? So that does actually matter. And it's the same amount of... Ah. Ah. Alien Hood. And I know that sets that are upgraded ah. give you powers. I don't know if the Hylian set counts. Alright, man. I'll see you tomorrow. Glad I'll see you tomorrow. Alright. I want to sell stuff. Mm, I swear I picked up some like opal and such. I did. <laughs> nice. Made back almost all our money. Finally in, in the hood. I see what she did there. I love that you don't have to load into buildings in this either. That's also very nice. Oh, so he's oh he's just painting that. Okay. Still neat that it's like on his screen. How could this happen? I don't know. Did Kakos escape? <laughs> oh no. Side quest, baby. Ten cacos. Holy cow. Alright, we're not doing that tonight. Or ever. 
I love barging into people's homes. What's this kid doing? Is he a dog or a child? Hard to tell. Hard to tell. There's one. Let's chuck you off of here. Where's the cuckoo pen? There it is. How far are you gonna go? Okay. Get in there. Just run in. Dang it! Alright, whatever. Got business to tend to. Go the wrong way? I did. Oh, there's a shrine in there? That's where. Oh, that's where I'm supposed to take the ball. From her house. Impa's house. Here we are. Give me the berry! Ah! on a fairy. I think I blew it. I'll take the nightshade, but I scared off all the fairies. How much money does she ask for? Hundred, yeah, that's fine. I think the next one asked for a thousand, and the next one asked for ten thousand or something like that. It's like some insane amount for the last one. I have the power. Sorry, that's a terrible He-Man, but hey, I'm only human. Sorry. Amazingly, this is the least creepy of all of the great fairies in all of the games. I'll never forget my first great fairy. Excuse me. In OOT. So I was like 12. We did that up. She came out basically, basically naked with super pointy pixelated boobs, and I was like looking around like I was gonna get in trouble for looking at it. <laughs> uh, N64. Fairy can ride dead horses? Really? Get out of town. Goblin horns. Yeah, we can do that. Nice. Uh, she, did she upgrade twice? Provide an Endura Carrot. Oh. So she can't upgrade twice. Yeah. What do I need for the hood? Oh well, I got my D-Rag on anyway for climbing. Uh -huh. <laughs> what do I need for this one? Why isn't it telling me that I can do this? Mm. Weird. Did uh -huh. you kill your horse something bad? Really? Is this real? I didn't know this. It's incredible. I feel like that was slightly glitched because it was saying that wasn't upgradable and it totally was. If you kill your horse and ask her to revive it. God, that's amazing. 
That's it. All right. Bye. Oh, is that the... It's like the mythical bunny over there. No. There's a bunny, like a blue mystical rabbit around here sometimes. <gasps> there it is. And if you follow it, it'll lead you somewhere. <coughs> so it's like, hey, you need to climb this. And there's like, you end up in like a special area full of blue animals and it does something. I can't remember now. In a minute. Since I played this game. Man, look at how freaking massive this map is. I love it so much. Like, look how far away the Ritos are. All right, I think that'll do it for me tonight. Because we've done pretty well. In a two hour, hour 45 minute stream, we got a lot of shrines. Wow. Um, six more shrines and Takakrika Village and a new tower. No, not a new tower. A new city. We got a horse. So I think that'll do it for this evening. Let's go ahead and save here. And uh, okay, so the deal for tomorrow, if we have enough people for friend day or we play Smash on stream live, then we will play friend day. Otherwise I will play Breath of the Wild uh, with a couple of beers in hand. So let's see if we can do that. Uh, either way, thanks for hanging out tonight, guys. Some awesome dude, thanks for having me. The, I forget what I was gonna say. Thanks for sticking around. Um, and uh, anybody else out there? I will see you hopefully next time. And uh, enjoy the rest of your night. Good night.